What's up wizards? We have a different kind of video today. 2022 was one of the most important years in my career. I gained 55,000 Twitter followers. I went from zero subscribers here to 20,000. I joined and left Vercel, one of the biggest dev companies out there, and I launched a TypeScript course. So, a lot happened. Let's start back at the beginning in January. At this point, I have 4,000 Twitter followers. You can look at my stats for January, like I've got kind of 134K tweet impressions, about 10,000 profile visits. In February, something happened, which is I posted a TypeScript tip to Twitter. This tip was about two minutes long. It's me describing an advanced TypeScript concept. And it got, you know, about a thousand likes at the time. Not only did it get a thousand likes, but it also got me about 400 new followers, like straight off the bat. I've been doing content about XState for a little while, but I hadn't seen this level of engagement. It was frankly like a little bit scary and like I tapped into something new. I knew it was different. So what I did was I sat down one Sunday at the start of March and I recorded 18 of these Twitter tips and I queued them up for Monday, Wednesday, Friday for the next kind of month or so. And look at these results. Look at this March. I gained 7,500 followers, did a lot more tweeting, but my God, so many more profile visits and tweet impressions. I kept it going into April, gained 8,400, doubled my tweet impressions, got a follow from Evan Yu. I carried on into May, carried on into June, although June I didn't do it so much. And I then get a follow from Lee Robinson. Now, Lee, if you don't know, is the head of developer experience at Vercel. He's one of my heroes, really, in terms of developer advocacy, someone who I always look to as an example of how you do it. He put up a post that he was hiring, and I thought, okay, why not take a chance and learn from the best? But... At the same time, I was riding this wave of thinking about all of this TypeScript stuff, these TypeScript tips, and I knew there was momentum. I put a link to a mailing list to sign up for, and boom, I got 3,000 signups. Already I knew, okay, right, I'm kind of in over my head here, I need some help. So I partnered with the crew at Badass Courses. These are the people behind Egghead. I knew that they'd do a great job with a lot of illustrations, a lot of the stuff that I didn't really know how to provide. And so while I applied for Vercel, I knew in the back of my mind, okay, I've started partnering with these people. I want to make sure I do a good job. Part of my contract for joining Vercel was I'll do Vercel three days a week and I'll do the course two days a week. And they said, that's great, but we really do want you full time at some point. So we'll do that for three months, then we'll revisit and see what happens. I had an amazing time at Vercel. I got to meet a lot of people who I admired for a long time, like Guillermo, like Jared Palmer. And I was lucky enough to work under them and see how they get ship done really fast. I also helped ship the docs for TurboPack. And I was part of the on the ground crew at NextConf in San Francisco, watching it get announced to the world. I couldn't believe that I was in San Francisco with Vercel watching something get launched into the Twitter sphere. But in the back of my mind, I knew that the course was the thing I wanted to be doing. During my time at Vercel, the mailing list went from 3,000 to around 19,000. So it came to October, I just left San Francisco, and I thought, I have to finish at Vercel. Isn't that a crazy decision to make? Like, I'm at my dream job as a developer advocate, doing what I want to do, learning from the best, but I have a better offer. Vercel was an amazing company to work for. They were extremely flexible. The quality of the people there was astounding. But for me, I just love working for myself. It's what I did for a long time before I was a dev, and so I wanted to get back to it. We launched the course. It's at totaltypescript.com, and it had a crazy reception. Over a thousand of you have bought it so far. We're trying to make it the premium TypeScript course on the market. And so for folks to think, okay, this is something I want to invest in was incredibly exciting for me. In terms of lessons learned, most of my lessons were learned on Twitter. I know that what works is two minute videos. If you can find nuggets of information that not that many people know, but you know that people will find important, then Twitter is the right place to deliver them. And even though a lot of my videos didn't go completely crazy and viral, they brought in about 300 to 500 Twitter followers per video. And it was that, the fact that you were seeing my face on Twitter, me posting regularly there, that got me the job at Vercel. And I think I happened to catch a lucky break because I was talking about something that not many other people were talking about. If you want to follow in my footsteps, then I suggest choosing something that you know really well, getting absolutely deep into it until you find the nuggets of information that are widely useful. Overall, I can't believe 
2022 happen to me. I really, really can't. I'm so grateful that you guys really have given me the opportunity to go full time with content creation. And I get to go back to a lifestyle that I love, which is making stuff on my own time. So thank you. If you like this video, if you want it to be shown to more people, then you should click the like button. It's a way of saying to YouTube, I got value out of this video, so please share it to more people. If you want to watch more stuff from me, there'll be a recommended video here. I can't think of anything that's quite related to this video that I want to show you, but it's been such a journey. So thank you so much, and I'll see you very soon.